great night, good to go. Managed to be warm enough uh, to sleep good. I was had a few uh, concerns about leaving the fire. You know, they got these uh, wildfires going on up here, and I ain't want to be no parts of that. You know, cause no problems with that at all. So, uh, any case, went ahead and uh, you know stayed up for fire watch for a while just till I felt secure in that uh, we wasn't gonna get any visitors or nothing like that. So. Uh, stayed up to probably about midnight and then crawled on into the shelter half into the uh, sleeping bag and uh, got up in there and the temperature went up and down kind of a little bit right around probably about you know maybe a three to four degree fluctuation um, but uh, forecast said it was supposed to be like 51 or 49 or something like that but I can't say that I really felt felt cold so um, a really good night so now we up cleaning up got our stuff together i had to uh <laughs> do some things over there this morning as with you know the rest of us that's tell you what that that that's how we supposed to go we supposed to go to the bathroom like that because now nah. three minutes and i'm out <laughs> no problems no binding no pushing it's gone so let me let y'all know, cop and squat, that's what you're supposed to be doing. Anyways, uh, we getting ready to do some breakfast. We brought some things, you know, we weren't crazy. We won't come out here and, on my first time just try to be all like, I'm gonna eat from the from the wilderness. Man, nah, I'd have been hungry than a mug out here if I tried that, but Dan knew what was up, man. Dan knew what was up, so he got it going on back there. It's popping. Getting it going, I think we'll have some omelets. I know he got some bacon, um, there's potatoes, and probably some veggies too, man. We got all kinds of stuff that we brought, good, nice, healthy stuff. So I don't know about that bacon, though. Nah. It, might be cheese, it might be cheese and ham yeah. omelet. It might be just cheese omelet. I don't know. I yeah, no all of that. Survival food, baby. So, hey, thank y'all for hanging with me. Go to the next segment. We're going to hit some trails, baby. The Rubicon Trail. In the G, the Desert Raider, baby, it's finna go down. Holla at y'all. H-Town, stand up. Desert Raider getting loaded up, baby. out of here trying to clean up the place make it as if we ain't never been here try to leave it as we found it as clean and natural as possible without human trash and all kinds of dumb stuff we're getting rid of everything so we definitely want to appreciate what nature has given us by not disrespecting it and leaving our stuff out here so anyways so we're getting up out of here y'all check that out G-Dub in the house. Look at that. There we go. Now I can say, been there, done that. Got plenty more to do though. We about to turn into a sportsman over here, baby. Yo, them fish, they jumping. They're making fun of us right now. They're out there hopping and doing all kinds of playful dolphin-like stuff. They're out there behave, misbehaving like a mug. They ain't want to come on in line, though, come in here. They knew what, it, what was good for them. 
They knew what was up. Right, y'all. We up. We up out of here.